welcome back to Boris and Natasha Wheelin' and Dealin'. This is uh, a mystery box that Boris ordered without telling me. <laughs> sorry. Yeah. Not, not sorry. He's not sorry. <laughs> I'm pretty excited about it, actually. I am, too, because I have no idea what it is. So this mystery box, actually, I saw this on uh, Bama Pickin' and Grinnin's channel. Uh, they have their channel, I'll throw up a little screenshot up there. Uh, please check their channel out, check that video. You can also see what they got in their mystery box. I will throw up a specific link to that uh, mystery box opening as well. Uh, so he found this $100 mystery box from uh, someone by the name of Valley Jack VTG, kind of like vintage. Now, of course, I'll throw screenshots up and links in the description. Uh, so he went through a box. I thought it was pretty cool. I thought it was kind of exciting. You know, you never know what's going to be in this this guy here. So I went ahead and, and uh, bought a box for us. Yeah, without but her it knowing. was like a hundred dollar mystery box. box. But how exciting is this? I mean, I hope that there's like gold bars in here or something. <laughs> but what I am going to, it's still sealed. We have not opened this up. So I'll kind of show you the whole box real quick. Here she is. I can't show their side because there's the address there. Um, but. I'm gonna be a gentleman and allow her to open up the box. Such a gentleman. I thought that was very nice of me. I'm so excited about opening this up. So you can't see it, it's down here on there the I table. Go. Open up the box. That's what she said. <laughs> I'm so excited. This thing is stuffed to the gills. You don't understand. I think it was like eight pounds or so, he, 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 uh, Jack told me. Super nice guy. Uh, I chatted with him on Instagram. If you want to uh, check him on Instagram, um, hit him up, and I'm sure he would be more than happy to uh, make another box. So watch out, I might cut you. Oh my gosh, it was dangerous. Okay, I think I got it. I think I got it. Okay, got it. All right, the box is somewhat open, as you can see. Oh my Atlanta. All right. Oh, okay. Wow. I see a little note. I'm not even sure where to start with this. I'm going to give you a quick little preview here because I'm already seeing some pretty cool things. And the way he has this packs is actually insane. Take a look at all this. A little sneak peek. Is that saran wrap? Everything's all like shrink wrap and saran wrapped. Well, it's definitely. And there is. I'm super excited about this, guys. <laughs> all right. So <clears throat> let's just start with the note, right? Yeah. Might as well. So, here's a nice little note here from Jack, as you can see. It says, thank you again. Inside have included various items. Some are newer, some old. Hope you enjoy. Go Bulls. Because <laughs> uh, I did tell him I was a, a fan of the Bulls. Of course, I was born in the 80s, and the Bulls were all the rage that, you know, the late 80s, early 90s. Um, he says, or maybe Lakers. <laughs> uh, from Valley, Jack, VTG, as you can see right there. So, uh, we got some stuff in there. We'll save that to the end, I guess. And I'm not sure where to start, but... Well, you can start with that one, and I'm just going to take the note off because I think it worked. We got this nice little thank you note here. This is actually fantastic. I really like this. So uh, we've been talking about getting some little thank you cards to put in the boxes and shipments that we that we uh, send out as well. So I thought that was pretty cool. Do a little quick image there. All right, so there's this whole brick <laughs> of stuff here. I mean, there's got to be no less than... 15, 20 shirts in there. I'm not really sure. Maybe 10, 15. But all right, let's get to it. Oh, this is like an actual printed picture. Yeah, that's really oh, yeah, cool. All right, so you want to start with this one? So again, we'll start with this little brick here and then we'll pull each piece out. Can show you. Scissors again? Nope, we're good without scissors. Nope. Don't cut the shirts. No, no. Okay. Oh my God, there's so many of them. There's so many in here. So. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. There's about nine shirts in total from what I can, from this particular brick. So I'm going in. I'm going right, one. Take the first one out, open her up, and see what we got. It's Disney. Oh. Look at that nice little Tigger head on the front. Anything oh, on the back? Yeah, that's oh. super cute. So it stay together. I'll stay together on the back. That's really, really cute. I love that. I did also tell him I was into uh, Disney things and things like that, sports stuff. Yeah, so, so I'm. Uh, if you watch our next video, <clears throat> we were in a 99 cent uh, challenge and uh, Boris bid and won a, what was it, like a jacket? A denim jacket? A denim, denim, yeah, yeah, denim, denim Winnie the Pooh jacket. jacket. With Winnie, Winnie the Pooh on it. And it's a size medium. So, 
I can fit a size me. medium. What are, you, what are you talking about? <laughs> Around his pinky finger. <laughs> all right, well, I'm a big guy, I'm girthy. It's all good. All right, so let's get to the next one here. We got uh, Walt Disney World on the front here. Beautiful graphic on the front. Anything on the back? Nope, nope nothing on the one. back. That's a really, still a really cool shirt though. What size is this one here? We got the Disney, it's on the Disney tag. Disney World. Large. Size large. So most of these items here, obviously we're, we're gonna be reselling. That's kind of the plan here once we get around to it. But uh, still, I just love all this type of stuff here. So I'll get a little closer so you can get a better look at the graphic. That's really cool. You wanna put that over there? Sure, you wanna take Thanks. the next one? I would love to. All right, next one up. On the Gildan Tag Heavyweight. You're gonna have to read this one for me. Hairway two. Oh, hairway to seven? Like stairway to heaven? <laughs> it's a play on that for sure, but this is a, yeah. a Pittsburgh Steelers shirt. This is Troy Palomalo, as you can see there. Um, not oh Brett Cassell is this guy over there. Uh, this is the part of the Steelers. The the aim remains the same. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so this is on the Gildan hit here. Uh, you can see the, the nice, beautiful graphic on the front. Look at that nice flowing hair of Troy Palomalo. Look at that. That's why he's all he's all in those shampoo commercials. Oh, yeah. Yeah, he is. <laughs> yep, he sure is. I'm a Bills fan, but I, I can still appreciate a nice shirt when I see it. And a nice head of hair, obviously. <laughs> all right, when is the next one? Go ahead. I did too. All right. Well, this one looks pretty funky cool here. So. <gasps> yeah, it does. This looks like a band t-shirt is kind of what I'm guessing off the front. Can you read that? Is that oh, Lady, Lady Gaga? Gaga? Yeah. Look at that Lady Gaga. That graphic right all the way up into That's the collar one. there. Yeah. Um, and then on the back here, I'll show you all real quick. Tour. Yep. It's all little, the tour dates and cities, not the dates, all the cities. Yeah. What a beautiful shirt that is. It's on the smaller side, but um, I think that's freaking awesome. Yeah, I think so too. I've never seen anything like that. All right, put that over there. Okay, don't go away. On the holding place, obviously. Thanks. Still the honors? <laughs> oh, so you get to go first. All right, we got a, we got the Beatles here. Um, look, this one here, as you can see, this one is on, oh, it's on the, the, the Beatles. Looks like official merchandise does say 2005 on it. Uh, I think that's really cool. Anything on the back? Nope. That looks to be probably what, like a size medium or so? Uh, probably large. Large, all right. All right, let's keep rocking and rolling here. Uh, so the next one here, immediately as I can, I can see here, is quite a bit of graphics on this. Oh, yeah. Oh, Panthers. Here? Panthers. Kind of, oh, that man, look like, at that, that graphic. Like That's absolutely beautiful. Yeah. Top to bottom. Yeah, look at the bottom part, too. It's really cool. That's pretty sweet. So this one is on a Short Hills T tag. And uh, can't wait. I'm thinking this is probably also in the medium large range. Would yeah. you agree? Yeah. That's Maybe pretty extra cool. large. Extra large. Yeah. Okay. Everything looks small to me. So if it's not 3X, I'm not fitting it. It's so extra large. Extra <laughs> large. Okay. That's a beautiful graphic on that. Yes. All right. We got two more in this little package here. Then we have the other one here we can open up. My turn? Oh, this might be long sleeve. I feel like it's longer. I knew oh, it! Oh man, look at Called that. Called it. What do we see here on the front? I see nothing yet. Because I'm looking That to me it looks like it's a graphic of Tupac. <gasps> Throw with the West Side symbol here. Oh my god, um, I love anyone that! A, anyone a fan of 90s rap will probably immediately recognize that. And guess what? It fits me, so we might not sell that. <laughs> <laughs> uh, this one here is on the Gildan Ultra Cotton uh, tag here as well. I think that's super cool. Yeah, that is I awesome. I love that. I may try to lose some weight so I can fit into this one. We'll see. Lies, you, you love Biggie, <laughs> not Tupac. I love them both. <laughs> All right. All right, the last one in this package here. You get to see, oh my gosh. I think I saw this on his, Golden on his Instagram. Mm -hmm. Golden Boy, Steph Curry. Everyone, if you're a fan of basketball, you absolutely know who this is right here. Actually, I saw, Jack, if you're watching this, I saw this on your Instagram. I, I loved it. I kind of thought it was sold. Otherwise, I was going to ask for it. But look at that graphic. That's absolutely beautiful. Yeah. I don't watch basketball, but I know Steph Curry's name only because my name's Stephanie. So. <laughs> that's, that's awesome. 
All right, I think this is, yep, it's a size large. Oh, that's cool. Right yeah, there. that's really, that's really cool. Kitchen. That is super cool. Look at that guy. Oh, this is definitely a woman's shirt. Look at because it has like the thing. I bet you it is a woman's shirt. Uh, do they make men's shirts that have like the. Oh, okay. I'm at the epitome of fashion, so I'm, <laughs> there's no way to know. <laughs> Good talk, Boris. All right, so that's everything we had in that first brick there. I think there was about nine shirts there. Yep. This one, oh, they both look like jerseys. Yep, looks like a couple different jerseys. By his message, uh, this note that he wrote, I'm thinking it's a little cryptic. It's probably a Bulls and a Lakers jersey. This definitely looks like the Bulls. Yeah. This definitely looks like I'm going to let you Lakers. open the Lakers one, and I'm going to open up the Bulls one. I'm okay with that. Should have brought the scissors. The scissors. Oh, goodness. So smart using the saran wrap. I'm gonna use it. <laughs> That's a good idea. Yeah, he was able to pack quite a bit in this box yeah. here. Oh, it looks like it's a couple Ooh, different things. Oh, they're pants. Oh, we got these Laker joints here. Oh, Look these at that. are they're bright. Oh. So freaking cool. So we got the Lakers hit right there. We'll turn it to the back here. Yeah. We got the starter right there on the back and this is absolutely gorgeous i love every bit of this yeah um it's on the uh looks like a yeah the starter tag here as well size large and it will kind of show you everything here from head to toe this thing is absolutely yeah. beautiful look at that i'd wear this if i could but <laughs> I, I probably can't. would too that's really really cool i like that yeah. oh wow that might there was a hidden shirt inside so i'm not sure uh, about this but i'm excited it was hidden inside the pants. <laughs> oh, we got we got a Lakers player here. I'm not picking the the player's name up. It looks familiar. I can't I can't get the name down. I'm not sure exactly who that is. It's 24. Number 24. It's definitely Kobe Bryant. I just yeah. I'll have to look that up. I'm not really sure exactly who that is. To be quite honest with you, uh, just the the picture doesn't match what I would expected, but. Um, Looks like the tag is kind of, as you can see, a little free here, so I can't even tell what that is. But I guess that matches with the Laker theme. Yeah. I like that now. But what I'm excited about, see the little B there. Looks like the Bulls. I see what you're saying. This wasn't as easy as I thought it was going to be. Yeah. I'm going to get into it one way or another. Okay. All right. So it looks like there's also two things in here as well. Ooh. The oh, first one yeah. here, I can tell right off the, the, the bat here, the, which, the Mitchell and Ness tag. Um, all right. Let's open her up. Number 21. Number 21. That looks to me like a Deion Sanders jersey on the Mitchell and Ness tag. Which will totally fit you. What size is it? I don't know. Let's say size 58. I do, I would, do feel like that should fit me. If you want me to do a fashion show with this, let me know. I'll be more please, than happy please to. Please comment. <laughs> I will do it if you guys ask for it, but I'm sure no one wants to see that. But this definitely will fit me, and I will be wearing this. That is really, really cool. Yes. I love that. I'll take that one. Thank All you. right. Now, on to what to be, appears to be a jersey of some sort. Oh boy, look at this guy here. So I'm not sure exactly what this is, but you're going to see... Are you Bulls. kidding me? This is a Michael Jordan when he was playing for the Bulls? It looks like it's some sort of combination of two different ones. That It says bullets on the front, as you yeah. can see. On the back, though, you got the Jordan. Of course, it was number 23. Uh, so definitely have to look this one up. Uh, there's a tag at the bottom. I'll show you real quick. Looks like it says, uh, yeah, 2003 Hardwood Classics. Guys, if you know anything about this, let me know. I have no idea no. what this is. Uh, I still love it either way because uh, I'm pretty sure you're not going to find another thing like this. No. It could be handmade. I'm not even sure to be quite honest with you. That is pretty freaking cool, though. Yeah, that's awesome. Look at that guy. I'll show the back one last time. All right, so... We got a couple jerseys. We got some pants mixed in here, about 10 different shirts. Super excited about it. If anyone knows anything about any of these things here, let us know. Uh, it's not stuff we're 
really familiar with, but of course we're gonna do our research after this, see what we have, and then uh, get these guys listed. So uh, big thanks again to uh, Valley Jack BTG for this box. I was super excited about it. Uh, it lived up to the hype. You told me it was packed full of goodies and it sure was. So <laughs> yeah, it was. Uh, thank you so much again. We really do appreciate it. Until next time. Peace and love. <laughs>